Hey guys, welcome back. So we're going to do another strainer pour here. Uh, this is a sink strainer. And as promised in the last video, if you saw, I coated the bottom of this with wet paint. So this has wet white paint underneath this strainer to help it flow a little bit easier. I wanted to kind of try that out. And I'm going to be basically using the same colors as the last one, which was uh, blues and turquoise, white, yellow, and black. So that's blue. Here we go with some turquoise. And here we go with some white. Yellow. little black okay basically we're gonna just keep doing that over and over um, so I'm gonna speed this up so that you guys can watch it in fast mode Okay, we're back. So I let this sit there for quite a while. I'm going to tilt it just a little bit and then we're gonna pretty much call that a day. Um, for those of you who have watched my channel for a while, you know that I'm not the biggest fan of uh, white negative space. Well, any negative space, really, but um, we're gonna end up leaving some on here. I do have an idea though, which I'm gonna actually try here. Just taking my straw. There we go, I think that adds to the flower look, plus then we have less negative space. <laughs> Without having to tilt it a whole bunch here. Cool. All right, there we go. I think I'm quite happy with that. One more right here. Okay. So let's go ahead and do our close up. All right, so we have the bottom right corner here. And let's go up to the top right corner. Upper left hand corner. And the bottom left corner over here. And then of course the middle. Oh yeah, and I forgot to say, you may have noticed in the sped up part that I Dripped a little bit of the yellow right in the center there because I definitely wanted it to have the flower look. All right, so there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I think putting the wet paint down first definitely, definitely helped it flow a lot better. Uh, plus just doing a little better portion control on my colors. <laughs> so I like this one a lot better. I will be playing around a lot more with, with these strainers. Um, to see what different effects and looks I can create. Anyways, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time.